to the shootings that have kept Milwaukee police very busy this weekend, the city has now surpassed 500 non-fatal shootings this year. That's in addition to the more than 130 homicides. Cassidy Williams with what we know about the string of violence this weekend. To lose them so suddenly, you know, it kind of break everybody up. Another spot marked by grief in Milwaukee. This is where 32-year-old Darnell Gordon was shot and killed early Sunday morning. It's just unfortunate because we lost a brother that literally, that literally will meet you here and you need a dollar for some gas and he'll give it to you, plus more. The shooting near 76th and Grantosa was one of eight separate shootings Saturday night into Sunday. The violence started around 740 near 16th and Mitchell. Police say a 23-year-old man was shot and taken to the hospital with serious injuries. Just 10 minutes later, a 24-year-old woman was shot near 17th and Scott. Police say she's expected to survive. A little more than a half hour later, a 34-year-old man was shot near 25th and Monroe. 20 minutes after that, a 27-year-old man was shot near 27th and Lisbon. He was also taken to the hospital. 11 minutes later, another shooting, this time near 14th and Atkinson. A 43-year-old man was shot but is also expected to survive. Then just before midnight, a 25-year-old man was shot near 15th and Washington. Around 1240, a 40-year-old man was shot near 22nd and National. Lastly, around 1 a.m., two men were shot near 76th and Grand Tosa. Police say a 29-year-old man was taken to the hospital and a 32-year-old man died. Family and close friends gathering there Sunday identified the victim as Darnell Gordon. This is not our first death. They say it's the second person they've lost in the last two weeks, and they are tired of building memorials. As a black community, we got to come, you know, we got to come to mutual understanding that everything don't revolve in going to get a gun. And at last check with police, no arrests have been made in any of the eight shootings. Anyone with information is asked to give them a call. Live in Milwaukee, Cassidy Williams. Fox 6 News. All right, Cassidy, thanks.